Hey, how are you? So today has been like an errands type day. Um, I'm not even done, but it is currently 2 p.m. <laughs> I don't know where the day has gone, but so far I went to the gym and then I went to Walmart and I wanted to give you a little grocery haul. And then later I want to hang up my new TV up on the wall. I just have to find um, some studs, hopefully. And what else? I got laundry going, tidy up the house. I currently just got back from Florida, visiting some family and especially my sister. Um, I became an aunt. Uh, so she had her first baby boy. He is the cutest thing I've ever seen and I love him so much. And I'm getting teary just talking about him because I miss him already. But yeah, aunt life is the best life. <laughs> Anyways, let me show you my grocery haul. Okay, here is my little grocery haul. Okay, so I got some Listerine. Um, this goes in your car for like your, when you, oh my gosh, what is it called? You pour it in your car for your wiper blades, the cleaner. <laughs> I got some 647 bread. I got the Christmas Coke. Well, I call this the Christmas Coke. Like I feel like it's, you know, it has the Santa. It's only, I feel like I only see the glass Coca-Cola around Christmas time. So I got some of those. I got this. It's gonna be delicious with some coffee in the morning, chips, some instant coffee candy for my candy jar okay this i seen a thing on tiktok where you take whatever brand chocolate cake you mix one whole thing of cool whip mix it together and you bake it and it's supposed to come out as like these delicious cookies so i'm gonna i'm gonna try i'll let you know some crackers some jiffy mix i'm gonna make um a corn casserole some fruits and veggies. Oh, this looked delicious. I am a goat cheese lover and this has to be good. Some like deli meats, turkey, salami, cheese, green beans. This is for the corn casserole that goes with the, with this. Um, that goes for the cookies, some croissants, I'm gonna make some pigs in a blanket. If you don't know what pigs in a blanket are, you take these little smokies and you wrap them in here and you bake them and they're delicious. I'm gonna actually put it on my charcuterie board. And then this is another, I got two of these. I'm gonna make this, um, the cinnamon rolls Christmas morning. I seen this other hack. So you take this heavy whipping cream butter and brown sugar i believe i have to look it up again and it's supposed to make it extra fluffy um i got a ham we're doing a ham um we did turkey for thanksgiving so i don't want to do turkey again last year for christmas i actually made lasagna and it was pretty good but this year we're gonna do a ham coconut water pineapple juice heavy whipping cream some, I know this is cheating, this is not real bacon, but <laughs> easy bacon, whole milk, almond milk, butter, sour cream, eggs, yogurt, and in my last video, I think it was my last video, I was talking about this brand of sauce, and the sauce is really good, but I seen that they had a pizza, so I'm excited to try that, and yeah. That's everything I got. I lied. I got these flowers as well. I don't know if they're coming up on camera, but they're like gold, green, and red flowers. Just be cute, put it in like a little vase on the center of the table. And then I actually got this sweatsuit, pants, and a, like a sweater, sweatshirt. It was only $7. I don't know if they were trying to get rid of it or what, but I was like, all right, steal. And purple is my favorite color, so. I'll take it. And then, yeah, now that's everything that I got.
so I got this package from Amazon, which is the TV stand for here in the living room that I want to put up. And it's supposed to be, so my TV is pretty slim, but this is supposed to be like a flat um, bracket because I want to eventually do that frame TV, like DIY frame TV. So let's see what this looks like. They got this big old box. I thought it was going to be big. I mean, it's long, but... Okay, this is what it is. So it says it holds a 37 by 70 inch. Um, I think they had bigger sizes. Obviously, it was more like... This one was only like 30 bucks. And my TV's a 65. So, what do I need? Oh, there's literally only like three steps. It says you mount the wall plate, attach the bracket to the TV, and then you just hang it on the wall. So I need to find, I don't know if I have a stud finder, but I need to find the studs on that wall. So okay, I just wanted to give an overview of everything that's in here. So this is like um, a paper like template for you to put on the wall to see like, you know, which screws you wanna use. This goes on the actual wall these two go on the tv directions and then all of the parts okay i got my level a stud finder my measuring tape and if you don't have the pencil and the back of on top of your ear are you really working okay let's see if there's any studs up here <laughs> spots so that's a good sign now i just need to measure where i want to actually put it oh and if you're wondering where the chachi man is he's right here say hi to your friends chach say hi say hi y'all don't take my advice on my measurement over here i literally sat on the couch decided where it was gonna go and I took account for the tree that is not going to be there all year. So I think it's, I think it's going to be good where I have it. So now I'm going to use the temp, little template that it came with and see if the holes match up. Oh, I need my level. Okay. It's right here. is gonna be great i know you can't tell in camera where the pencil mark is but let me get the right screws and get this going <laughs>
this was a short and sweet little video. I hope you guys enjoyed my little Walmart haul and this TV frame. I will leave a link down below if you need a TV frame. Um, yeah, I think it was like 30 bucks. But anyways, thank you so much for being here and watching. And I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas. Thank <laughs> you.